हेलो टिकीज वेलकम टू आवर अनदर वीडियो सीरीज ऑफ एक्सेल ऑटोमेशन यूजिंग एम एस पावर ऑटोमेट डेस्कटॉप इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी विल लर्न अबाउट सेट एक्टिव एक्सेल वर्कशीट एक्शन सो लेट्स डिस्कस फर्स्ट व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ सेट एक्टिव एक्सेल वर्कशीट सो फॉर डूइंग दिस लेट्स ओपन वन एक्सेल स्प्रेड सीट एंड सी व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ एक्टिव सीट so first of all here i am opening challenge dot xlx file here you can see our active sheet is first sheet after using set active excel worksheet if you want to change this active worksheet as per your requirement like if you want to change active worksheet as a sheet 1 then you can change with the help of set active worksheet action and also we can change as per your requirement last sheet and so on so that's about set active excel worksheet so let's open power automate desktop and see all the parameter of set active excel worksheet and after this we will also see the practical example of this action set active worksheet action so now i am on pad power automate desktop let's create a flow just click on new flow plus icon to create a new flow here after this in flow name section you can mention your flow name as per your project requirement like excel automation wave automation file and folder automation and so on and after this just click on create button and just wait for a while here you can see your flow has been created successfully excel wave file folder desktop automation so let me explain about or parameter of set active worksheet action so for finding in action panel just type in search action here set active excel worksheet and just drag and drop here here you can see set active excel worksheet itself say activate a specific worksheet of an excel instance it means if you want to set a any specific sheet if you want to activate as per your requirement just use set active excel worksheet action let me explain all parameter here you can see activate worksheet action with here is the two way to activate by name or by index so by name you can select by name and here you can mention as per your requirement here you can mention your sheet name uh, if you want to activate that sheet just mention that sheet name here and another way just select index and here you can put the index so that your uh, that sheet is activated with the help of set active excel worksheet action so that's all about set activate worksheet action i hope you understood about this action so i have already created a flow for this with the help of set active excel worksheet and also i am using one uh, another action that is get active excel worksheet i have already discussed in our previous video if you did not watch it go and watch i will also put the link in description so let me explain first what i did in this flow using launch excel uh, action i am opening challenge dot xls aspirate sheet after i am using get active excel worksheet to to get first which one is which sheet is activate currently and i am using here display message box and i am in message box title i am mentioning here before using set active excel worksheet action what is the current active sheet and after this i am using set active worksheet to change the current active sheet and here i am you uh, selecting name property 
एंड हियर आई एम मेंशनिंग फर्स्ट सीट टू एक्टिवेट फर्स्ट सीट नेम दैट इज वाई आई एम सेलेक्टिंग फर्स्ट सीट आफ्टर दिस आई एम यूजिंग हियर गेट एक्टिवेट एक्सेल सीट सो दैट वी कैन सी दैट सीट इज एक्टिवेटेड और नॉट फर्स्ट सीट इज एक्टिवेटेड और नॉट आफ्टर आई एम यूजिंग डिस्प्ले मैसेज टू डिस्प्ले आफ्टर यूजिंग सीट एक्टिव एक्सेल वर्कशीट एक्शन फिच सीट इज डिस्प्लेइंग इन दिस मैसेज बॉक्स एंड आफ्टर आई एम यूजिंग क्लोज एक्सेल एक्शन टू ऑलरेडी ओपन क्लोज एक्सेल दैट इज वाई आई एम यूजिंग क्लोज एक्सेल सो लेट्स रन द फ्लो एंड सी वट इज द आउटपुट ऑफ दिस फ्लो फॉर रनिंग बिफोर रनिंग दिस फ्लो लेट सी वट सीट इज करेंटली एक्टिव नाउ हियर यू कैन सी सीट वन इज करेंटली एक्टिव आफ्टर रनिंग दिस फ्लो यू कैन सी विच सीट इज एक्टिव सो लेट्स रन and see what is the output of this flow so your flow has been executed now you can see before seat 1 is displaying after this seat name first seat is displaying so let's open this file and see which one is activate now see here first seat is active currently because we are activating with the help of Set active Excel worksheet. Here you can see I am mentioning first sheet. That is why it is activating first sheet. Let's here disable this action and enable this one to check with another property and the our another property is index. Here I am mentioning theory. So let's run and see what is the output of this flow. Here you can see your flow has been executed now say see first sheet and after this last sheet is displaying because you are here you are using index 3 let's open and see the challenge.xls file here you can see index number 3 is activated and then index number 3 sheet name is last sheet so i hope you understood about set active excel worksheet So thank you for watching this video we will meet in a next video